Hey everybody, welcome back to TQM Travels. Today we have returned back to the Blue Ridge Mountains in order to check out another Georgia State Park. This time we are going to be hiking and exploring through Tallulah Gorge State Park. So we're probably going to have a bit of a shorter episode today because we're not doing any camping or anything. We're just going to be spending the morning here in Tallulah Gorge. But in order to spice things up a little bit, we have a special guest today. Joining us on our hike is going to be Lisa's sister, Becca. I don't think we've seen you since... Uh, like our hiking up in out west, right? In 2019, is yep. that, it's been a while since Becca's been here on the channel. Lisa was not feeling too well today, so she wanted to stay home. So Becca said she is going to join me on our hikes. Our plan today, Becca, in case you don't know, mm -hmm. is we're gonna be hiking about three miles of trails. We have a couple of rim trails that just sort of walk along the edge of the uh, gorge. And then we're also gonna be going on what's called Hurricane Falls Trail, which is a series of staircases to go to a suspension bridge that crosses over the gorge. So that's gonna be our plan for today. Are you excited today? Oh no, staircases. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we did the Amicola Falls staircase, which was pretty tough. So I think this is gonna be a little similar. It might not be quite as many stairs, but I honestly don't know. So we'll see you guys out on the trails. All right, so we're on the Hurricane Falls Trail now. As you can see, it's just a bunch of these uh, wooden stairs. So you start on the north rim where we were, go down the stairs, then you can cross the bridge and it'll connect to the south rim trail. And then that'll actually loop around near the highway that we actually passed coming into the park. And you will be able to loop back here to the north trail. So this is the first time I've seen this on a trail like this, but there's uh, water fountains and water bottle filling stations here on the trail also, so that's pretty cool. And now you can see the bridge. All right, so we're here at the suspension bridge now. This is sort of like one of the main attractions of the gorge here. So we're gonna take a couple of pictures and uh, videos here, and then we will cross over the gorge in order to head over to the south rim. And we'll be doing that entire south rim trail and loop back over to the north rim trail. All right, so we've crossed the suspension bridge now. We're going to climb up the stairs in order to go to the South Room Trail. 
as you can see, it says we have to climb up 347 stairs. So it's going to be a bit of a trek. Are you? Is that less than Alcoa? Or is that more? I think it's a, I think it's a little less. I don't remember okay. though. That's not good. <laughs> so that actually is a, a good transition though, Becca, because so with completing this trail here, this will actually make me an unofficial member of the Georgia Canyon Climbers Club which is a real thing you can sign up for. I think it's like a $10 membership fee, which I'm not planning on paying, but I will have completed all of the trails for that. It's crossing this suspension bridge here, climbing up all of the stairs at Amicalola Falls, which Beck and I did in 2019, hiking to the bottom of Providence Canyon, which Lisa and I did a couple of months ago, and then also climbing the stairs to the two waterfalls in Cloudland Canyon, which Lisa and I did at the end of last year, so. I am now an official member, unofficial member, of the <laughs> Canyon Climbers Club here in Georgia. So, are you ready to start climbing some of these stairs, Becca? Yeah. I'm sure we're going to take several breaks along the way up, but here we go. Oh, man. Where are the benches? I think they're up there. That's too far. I know. Uh, Who it? All right, we finished the Hurricane Falls Trail. It was pretty tough, but I do think you were right, Beck. I think this had less stairs than Amicola Falls did. This one was pretty tough, but we only took, what, two or three breaks or so? It wasn't too bad. So now we're just going to be on the easy part for the rest of the trail because we're going to do the South and North Rim Overlook Trails. So they should be significantly easier. So let's go. Uh, Take a look at the overlooks. You ready to get some more photos? Yes. All right, here we go. away from the visitor center that we'll be getting. Now we just have to backtrack a little bit and then we'll take the rest of the South Room Trail to connect to the North Room Trail along the highway and then head back to the visitor center. the north trail you can actually continue on to another little trail here to go to the inspiration point overlook it's only a quarter mile but it looks like it's got a little bit of elevation gain so let's see what it looks like all right so we've made it to the overlook here it was a good steady climb but it only took us about five minutes I'm pretty tired though how, how do you feel <laughs> she's good
All right, so Becca and I are all finished up with our hiking here at Tulula Gorge State Park. What do you think, Becca? Do you like the, the hike today? It wasn't that bad, it was pretty short. Yeah, it was, it was nice and easy for the most part too, apart from the stairs at the Hurricane Falls Trail. Everything else on the rim trails was really flat and easy. That's gonna be it for today. Thank you all so much for checking out this episode. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe to the channel and ring that notification bell so you can be notified when our next adventure is. If you haven't yet, also be sure to give this video a thumbs up so we can help the channel grow. And until next time, guys, cheers.